सो हे गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइज टूडे आई टीच यू न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ सी जी आई प्रोडक्ट एडवर्टाइजिंग एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग ब्लैंडर एंड एफ स्पायड ऑन सी गाइज दैट माई रियली कूल वी एफ एक्स आर्ट वर्क राइट एंड गाइज आई शो यू माई रेंडर प्रिव्यू सो क्लिक ऑन हेयर या सी गाइज दैट माई रेंडर प्रिव्यू एंड गाइज आई शो यू माई बैनर सो सी गाइज दैट माई बैनर आई क्रिएट दिस बैनर इन ब्लैंडर Okay, so guys, next one I use this time as pi add-on for this flow. Okay, so guys, now I create new. So guys, go to on file and guys create new project and go to on Blender and same new check, right? Okay, so guys, select your all assets and press delete key and guys now select firstly and I show you my simple image. See guys, that's my simple image. and guys i convert to in 3d so guys go to on here that's my aspire so guys select your image so simple drag and drop this image on aspire add on yeah okay see guys that's my vanishing point guys i create this time x and z so guys go to on blender see guys that's my this one that's my z and guys second one x one okay so guys go to on here and firstly Guys, X and second one, I like Z, like this. Guys, now I create like a perspective effect. So, guys, go to on here number two, here, and guys create position, and guys see that's my like a perspective effect, like this, right? And guys go to on here, simple, good, and guys select this one. Guys, I create like a perspective effect, and guys, now create grid. So grid, guys, this time use this one X Y, this one that max Y grid, and guys apply on here. Yeah, see, guys, that's my simple grid, right? Okay, so guys, my work is finished, and now guys go to one file and save your footage, this one image, and guys go to one desktop like a type. New cam and press save, right? And go to on Blender and go to on File. So guys, import and import as pi add-on this one file. And guys, I have this one new cam import. Yeah. So guys, select your camera and guys, opacity hundred percent check. And guys, same. I take plane. That's my flow. So increase flow like this. and guys change position yeah position change and guys this time i create like a loop cut so guys edit mode select edge and guys right click loop cut slice and cut yeah and guys go to on here in corner like this guys select this one okay so guys see that's my y axis so guys press e and y and create shape like this and guys select this one and that's my x axis so press e and x and create shape like this yeah that's it guys that's my flow and press zero yeah that's my simple flow and guys next one i apply plane for plane guys i take one more this time plane simple and rotation change so x rotation 90 and guys attach on this one so increase scale size like this and little bit more yeah guys little bit back here yes so guys that's my simple plane and increase scale size yeah and guys now go to on edit mode so select vertex go to on up like this and select this one and guys see that's my like a wall okay it's good right okay so guys all is good and now guys select this wall and rename like a wall and guys next one i create sliding banner animation so guys duplicate this wall so press control c and v and guys you can hide this wall hide select this one and like a banner Right, that's my banner, and guys, change scale size. 
and guys little bit up like this guys that's my banner yeah good and guys little bit down little bit yeah that's it guys right okay so guys all is good and now guys this time and guys edit mode select this face and right click guys subdivision surface so go to on here number of cut i like 60 yeah that's my number and guys go to on here wireframe check right see guys that's my simple vertex and guys next one i apply this time cylinder so guys go to on here mesh and use cylinder and cylinder that's my vertex and like a double 64 and guys that's my radius half 0 0.5 and depth like a 10 i will change this height okay so guys now okay so guys go to on edit mode and select this one edge that's my vertex and guys now i create rotation effect rotation cube so guys edit mode and select all vertex and guys press r and y and guys 90 yeah see guys that's my rotation edit mode change object press one and go to on up like this and guys don't overlap and increase this height like this little bit more yeah good right and little bit change yeah that's it guys that's my height okay so guys now go to on up so guys click on here and up guys see that's my cube cylinder and that's my plane guys don't overlap right okay so guys now go to on here and like this and press one three yeah guys go to on mid like this and little bit down yeah that's it guys right see that's my cylinder and that's my plane and guys now i create rotation animation banner rotation so guys press one and select your banner plane and go to on edit mode so guys select your first top vertex right select top four so guys select your top vertex and guys go to on here and go to on group that's my vertex group and assign check yeah that's it right and guys now go to on vertex and go to on hook and create new hook this one and check that's it right that's my hook okay so guys now i create rotation animation so guys see that's my simple cylinder and guys i create rotation and guys rotation animation like this i create z rotation so guys frame rate i like 500 is good and guys check so go to our last 500 frames like a 720 and check yeah that's it guys and guys select your key and press t liner and liner check most important part guys use liner select all keys frame and press t and use liner and next one guys so guys go to on here and select your hook see guys that's my hook this one that's my hook and select your second one holding shift key select cylinder and press ctrl p that's my parent so object keep transform check yeah that's it guys so guys preview check yeah that's my rotation effect okay but guys see that's not rotate so guys this time i apply cloth tag so guys select your this one and plane and cloth check so guys see that's my stiffness i like one one and one and then dumping alt one okay so guys go to on here that's my shape and pin group use group that's my top vertex and collision check and see guys that's my self collision check and now guys select your this one cylinder so guys i apply collision check yeah and guys preview check yeah see guys that's my simple 
like a banner rotation animation right okay so guys now you can create more smoothness shade smoother check and guys i apply subdivision surface and check yeah and one more time preview yeah much better right see guys the axe my simple banner rotation animation and guys now you can de increase depend on your work guys and guys play yeah that's my simple rotation animation okay so guys now is dependent your work you can increase more speed that's my speed increase so guys select your cylinder and last like a 1000 and check and one more time preview check yeah much better see guys that's my simple rotation effect that's my first animation and now guys you can apply texture so guys select and you go to on shading and guys i create new new material check and press ctrl t press ctrl t and apply any texture like this and import yeah yes okay so guys flip your texture and rotation change okay so guys by one yeah like a 180 yeah that's my rotation flip and guys roughness and metallic like increase roughness little bit decrease actually yeah 0 0.6 is good okay so guys go to one preview that's my camera and render preview guys wireframe height yeah good right see guys that's my first composition first animation and preview check actually that's my animation yeah that's my simple rotation animation okay so guys next one i apply light and change render setting so guys stop and guys i use cycle render divide gpu check like a 256 render and guys i change like a 128 and go to on here fill and transparent check and color management change standard and go to on here world property and guys i apply simple sdri texture sdri so apply this one and import i like this this one yeah and guys stand 0 0.8 and next one guys i apply sunlight so go to on light and i apply sunlight and up right and guys rotate like this that's my banner okay so guys little bit up and now guys select your sun and strength one is good and angle 20 enter 20 yeah that's it and guys select your plane this one and guys go to on here and visibility and shadow catcher check right okay so guys now go to on wall and see guys that's my wall so guys select and little bit back little bit yeah right that's my wall and increase scale size so guys go to on edit mode select wall and increase scale size like this select that's for my shadow and guys select your wall so shadow catcher check and guys go to on here okay so guys preview check yeah that's my animation and guys next one i show you my simple render preview one frame render and guys click on here render image check okay so guys my one frame render is finished and guys now go to on here compositing and compositing check so guys i change some node settings so press holding shift and a and image check i apply first image and apply same image and click so guys next one this time shift a and alpha over check so guys connect first one image to alpha over and this one render layer second one and guys next one i use viewer viewer and apply like this yeah and press v yes see guys that's my realistic render preview realistic banner and guys next one second animation guys i create like a floating and burger 
सो गाइस आई क्रिएट न्यू कलेक्शन चेक लाइक अ बर्गर एंड गाइस आई क्रिएट इंपोर्ट योर बर्गर सो गाइस आई हैव थ्री मॉडल लाइक दिस अप एंड गाइस आई डाउनलोड दिस बर्गर इन स्केच फैक या एंड गाइस फोर टू ऑन हेयर सेलेक्ट हेर आर की चेक यस एंड गाइस आई क्रिएट एनिमेशन so guys location change out of frame yeah that's it and go to an up like this and guys now press i and guys use that's my location and rotation check and guys i change this time y axis is good and go to on here like this go to on last 500 frames and change position like this and press guys also rotation change like this and change yeah good and press i and change yeah and guys keyframe press t and line a check and preview yeah see guys that acts my like a floating burger animation guys now you can apply more burgers depend on your work so stop and guys now select your burger and guys duplicate so guys shift d go to on up and guys rotation change like this yeah and press i and change rotation yes and guys now go to on last and guys little bit change position and guys location like this yeah yes and press i and check yes and preview and guys play preview check yes see guys that's my simple animation it's looking really good right okay so guys now you can apply more object burger is depend on your work but guys that's my tutorial part it's my like a simple rough layout okay so guys my animation is finished so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel and guys lastly stop and see guys that's not full so guys select your cloth and go to on here catchy and guys i change this and catchy like a same 500 and check yeah that's it guys right and one more time preview okay so guys my work is finished so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you